I used to work in the prison before, but that was a long time ago when I was a young man. And uh, this S. Iswaran's case, the ex-minister of transport's case, I would like just to highlight, talk a little bit about it as far as I know uh, regarding the condition of the prison. S. Iswaran uh, is sent sentenced to 12 months in prison starting from the 7th of October 2024. Although it's a 12-month sentence with good behavior, the CRO or conditional remission order may apply to him, in which means he will get one-third remission like one third discount, no? So he probably serve, he will serve probably around eight months, yes. I'm sorry, eight months, that's right. Because 12 months, you take away one third is eight months. So he probably by June next year, June 2025, he would be released. Of course, the, <clears throat> the other thing is the toilet in his small little cell of six point nine square meter is the squatting type. Yeah. Unless you are an old fella and no immobile, you know, you're a sick person, then the prison authorities will let you have a cell with a squatting toilet in it. The cell will be monitored by CCTV cameras twenty four hours a day. Yes. And um he probably would have to spend 23 hours out of 24 in his cell. And he's given uh, a mat and one or two blankets. But he won't be mixing or sharing their cell with other inmates because uh, of his uh, previous occupation. Like if you're a government servant, you're a police officer or, or an army officer, then it's a risk factor if you, you don't share with the other criminals, so he'll be alone in his cell. This is as much as I know. If you have any question, please uh, leave it in the comments below. Thank you.